6 years, first met at the club, and that's how we started out as friends. We exchanged our vows in Santorini before we came back to Singapore to have the wedding banquet. I woke up very early, the photographer and the makeup artist start coming. I went in the room, all Jillian sitting there. At that moment, I feel very, very happy and touched that previously I didn't thought that this day would happen. Then after that, we had the tea ceremony. My dad was the first one. So my dad was like, you know, getting all emotional, then crying, then I'm like, why are you crying? Then my dad said, like, I'm very touched. Finally, somebody wants her daughter. <laughs> Actually quite surprised that like during tea ceremony, both our parents and relatives gave us like dowry. gold for dowry, like those gold bangles. We were shocked, we are really shocked. Really very touched. La. Touched. Yeah. That although it's like, you know, uh, it's not really recognized in Singapore, but they take it seriously. So around 7, the uh, guest starts coming. Then after that, uh, we had our wedding banquet. We were very surprised that all the guests were like full attendance. Yeah. Like everyone came. At around 8 o'clock, we had our first March day. Then we mingle a bit, cut the cake. During the Yam Sing, usually it's like your direct family and some relative and the brothers and bridesmaids will sure be up on stage. So everyone goes up on stage already. It's like 50 people down on below the stage. So it's pretty empty but it's it's kind of fun that you see mom and your dad standing beside you hosting to everyone even though it's a lesbian couple. The relative they were host with you, they want to try and make you drunk, but instead they get drunk themselves. <laughs> can see that our parents are really very happy. Yeah. At first our family are pretty conservative, but as time goes by, they see the happiness in us, they slowly accept and to the extent that they will attend our wedding dinner and go through so much with us. So I hope our story can inspire you. We hope that you know. Next time, everyone can, you know, get married in Singapore, regardless of who you choose to love.